finish 3 0 to Brighton at the Emirates is a very sad day for us at the Arsenal faithful here. Um, simply, um, for me, in my perspective, Arsenal were played off the park from start to finish. Arsenal didn't look like they deserved anything from that game. They looked very slow, sluggish. Let me introduce my men. You already know them. Yoki, what's up, man? It's been a minute. My brother, last PJ, time, last time. CJ's angry. <laughs> I'm happy, man. I'm happy. CJ's angry. CJ's angry. Man's angry. Man's angry. Man's angry. Man's angry. Man's angry. Everybody's pissed off. Yeah. Let me start with PJ because PJ has a lot to say, man. Well, for me, really and truly, I think it's just about the mentality, you know. Um, I love history. Yeah, people just will just argue. Uh, the players are tired and all, but I say Leicester did the same thing. Leicester did it. So yeah, we're not gunning for the league, but at least put on a fight. Three nil. This is the worst performance this whole season, and the manager. To be honest, has done his best. I think it's the players. Saka has been out for like 20 matches. He's not playing anything. So for me, that's my own um, perspective. Yuki, my brother. Well, first and foremost, I want to say shout out to the team. And I mean, they, I had so many unbelievable moments this season. Um, but right now, I'm not too happy. Uh, it's mixed feelings. I mean, I felt this match right here was, I mean, was, was terrible. It's terrible to see the way we're playing it looks like the team is gone they cast out or their mentality maybe they won the match where man city won three nil and they just felt look we lost this league when they saw the class and everything so i don't know if i was the manager i don't think i would have allowed them to work the man that's if they did you know or, the, or know about the result or know about the result but it's I, very hard with social media yeah, no i i baba yeah. we're fighting we, before the title will you take their phones if it was alex ferguson let me go back you will collect all their phones like children. But if they, they, there was no social media then now. No, they will I'm telling you that if someone if they did now, these are the things that they would do. They those guys were very strict. There are some things that you still have to be strict with. Just get everybody's phones. I'm picking up for two, three hours. You guys, I need you to concentrate. Face what you are. What is leave Man City. And we had we had, we had like seven days to prepare for that game. Yeah. yeah. And Brighton played me beat against And they lost and they lost five and they one lost five one to So what's I mean, what no excuse for this? I'm thing. telling you that I feel it's just what a morale. It was their morale. They just entered into they they were already defeated before they even came into the pitch. Yeah. 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 I saw it in the body language. CJ yeah. Alpha. Yeah. yeah man, Blink on <laughs> next on to next season. On to yeah. next season. Some players. Yeah. It's been a good ride though. It's been a good yeah, season still. I mean it's been exciting. Expect to challenge for the title, um, but we're here. We we secured second. I mean, my voice is low because it's, 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 it's I've been uh, all week. I've been permutating on how and what way where where Man City could possibly drop points and how we can you know I'm still dreaming. But yeah, ah, so I guess I guess it's, uh, we we'll keep dreaming. It's, 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 it's over, man. Go go go! It's it's over. Next, over. Yeah, next year. Yeah, next year. The only positive in this season is that we made Champions League. I'm telling you. I mean, yeah. no, which is a great positive. Yeah. Man. And we saw that we finally have a team that we can build on, yeah, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, if you look at it, my G, uh, this team, I feel we can actually now attract quality players. Yes. Yeah. First one in Europe. Do you understand? And we have quality players that are there too as well. You know, so I think we're go I think we're gonna get better. Like we're actually gonna get better. That's yeah, the, the players are young. Yeah, Most of them 20, young. 21. Don't sell the key players. Can sell off one or two of the old guard, the old red guard, or anything, and then you know, bringing quality players and experienced players because we have the young guys, but we need experienced guys into the team that can Man. also ginger them. You know, have fun. Man, mine is just mixed feelings though because <laughs> I kept on praying to God, quoting Bible verses, <laughs> <laughs> hoping that something will come up. But I think season is done, man. Like we're well, done, done. Hopefully next season we we'll fight again. At least we're in Champions League, um, competed properly for most of like three games to go. Yeah. Uh, so they gave it a good fight compared to last season that we, we couldn't even make top four. So it's progress. It's progress. It's yeah. actually progress yeah. because I think Arsenal have overachieved this season. If yes. you look at the team we have, the yeah. squad in there, being in Europa, yeah. the injuries we have had, the World Cup coming in. And uh, to be honest with you, yes, people are saying we are bottled the league, but we're going against a team that averages 96 a season. Bro. And Liverpool tried tried it against them four times or five times. They only won once. And they had to spend a ton of money. The they spent 75 pounds. million on Van Dijk. They bought Salah. They bought Fabinho. You know. They bought Alisson. 
I think we need to do what Liverpool did. If we yes. want to go to that next level, we need to spend heavy money on some heavy positions, maybe in centre-back especially, yeah. midfield. I get a striker who wants to score goals. Exactly. exactly. I get a striker who wants to score, wants goals. To score goals. I, I, think, I think we need to... We need players. Because, yeah. I, like, next week, I already know our lineup. But trust me, for Pep... You cannot know You cannot know his line. That guy has three players for almost every week. You can't know his line. I think... It's a billion pounds team, bro. We need a lot of It's a billion pounds team. Because everybody knows that Saka, whether that go left or right, they will double team him. He's done. He's done. Man, then he will try to run. Yes. Got to this. But when... You don't even know whether well, Saka, changed yeah, the pattern. Saka is good. And yeah. I'm very disappointed in Trussard today, though. Yeah. For yeah, keeping us Because yeah. he's playing against his former team. team. There, should be, go harder. there should be more motivation yeah. to play today. He just yeah. came yeah. in and he cost us the goal. He cost us the goal. I'm very disappointed. I think... And you know, the first half was so... There was no it rhythm. It was so flat. Too flat. Yes, we had too much stop and play. Too many injuries. This one is falling down. This one, that one, that one, that one. I don't know. I'm even wondering what Atata did in the dressing room. Yeah. We came out worse. We came out worse. We came out like we, we, we just gave, say take the ball, do whatever you want to do. And um, one long ball. It's not like they have Haaland. One long ball. Yeah. Maybe again we're missing Zinchenko. We're because, missing Saliba. Is, no, hold on. Because we're too you used to dead. that yeah. that, that time. Yeah. So today, playing the flat back four, maybe that was why they struggled. Because I know if you had Zin, it will come out. But well, this is fresh. why you need people like Shaka to step Grand, up. Exactly. This, this to be, be honest. People like Shaka to step up and take charge and be like, okay, the is not He's here not today. around. Yeah. I'm the midfielder. I'm the leader. This is my game to control. And it's crazy how Kaiseido, even at right back, has more influence. Arsenal than should buy that midfield. player. Arsenal should buy that guy tomorrow. I'm telling you, just tomorrow. sign him up tomorrow, man. Tomorrow. Straight. Well, it's finished three 0 Everybody's sad. Everybody's down. But for me, I'm just gonna say. I'm very happy. I'm very proud of this, League, Arsenal, of, yeah, of this Arsenal <laughs> team this season. They've given me a lot of highs and a lot of views too. And also, I think next season, we're going to be bigger. We're going to be better. We're going to be stronger. So anybody who is below you that is trolling you, man, them niggas is stupid. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification button. It's Turn On TV. Peace.